Hi everybody, good Wednesday afternoon. Meteorologist Griffin Hardy in for Chris Justice tonight, and we've got some improving weather. Finally, some good news to talk about. Some sunshine over top of Western North Carolina this afternoon. Here's a live look at that Asheville sky cam. It's on the chilly side, no doubt about it. It's the sun is out, but it doesn't really feel like it. Still 42 degrees in Asheville right now. With that north wind, it feels more like 36 degrees outside. A little bit of a wind chill in the air. Uh, the rain has stopped in Greenville, but the clouds have kind of stuck around this afternoon. Mostly cloudy in Greenville right now as temperatures sit in the mid 50s across most of the upstate 55 in Greenville this afternoon, 56 for Anderson, more low in mid 50s across most of Northeast Georgia and some 40s up in Western North Carolina, where the colder air has definitely already started to settle in. Here's a look at those high clouds in the visible satellite picture. There's the line between the sunshine and the clouds. You see most of the upstate still kind of blanketed with those mid and high level clouds where we're getting a little bit more sunshine in Western North Carolina. Luckily, no rain, though. Yesterday's rain was the last chance of rain we have through the rest of the week. We're going to be staying pretty dry. Here's a look at that hour by hour for the rest of the night tonight. Temperatures dropping down into the 30s and 40s by 8 o'clock. Another cold night ahead as the sky clears out gradually. We'll see a mostly clear sky early tomorrow morning with the possibility of maybe some brief flurries up in the mountains just north of Buncombe County towards Yancey County. May get a little bit of snow flurries there, but the rest of us staying high and dry and cold tomorrow morning. Upper 20s, low 30s for uh, temperatures tomorrow morning, so we'll briefly dip below freezing. Then for tomorrow, I think we see more sunshine than clouds all across the area. So we were cloudy today in the upstate. I think we'll see more sunshine tomorrow. Should be a nicer day, all things considered. Temperatures still on the chillier side, though, with highs tomorrow only in the upper 40s and 50s at the warmest. So it's going to be still below average for this time of year. So yesterday, we picked up around half an inch of rain in total across most of the upstate GSP. We had 0.48 inches Asheville picking up six tenths of an inch around half an inch in Clemson as well. Greenwood a little bit lower at a quarter of an inch. And once again, that's the last of the rain that we're going to see the rest of the week. So the drought conditions, uh, this is this drought monitor hasn't quite been updated yet. We'll get another update for this tomorrow uh, that will include the rain that we saw from Nicole and yesterday's rain. So hopefully this improves a little bit. But uh, again, this is uh, this. It's, it's just going to be a dry, cold week ahead. Here's what we have for the four day sunny and cold tomorrow. Still more of uh, no big changes ahead for Friday and Saturday. More sunshine and cooler temperatures as high stay in the 50s across the upstate and low stay in the upper 20s. A little bit more cloud cover heading into next week with some smaller chances of rain Tuesday, Wednesday. Those long range models hinting at a possibility of maybe some showers heading into Thanksgiving and Black Friday. That's still pretty far away, though, so we'll be ironing out those details and get a bit, a little bit more clarity on that heading into this weekend. In the meantime, though, we stay dry and cold in the mountains as well. Highs in the upper 40s, lows in the lower 20s, very below normal for this time of year. Normal low is 36. We're in the 20s, so 10 degrees or more below average for this time of year. That continues into the weekend as the clouds uh, increase heading into next week.